this is the melon you can see how dirty it is very dirty but dirty very dirty let's go and wash it now this is the soap i am going to use to wash it soap for to wash for the bottle that's what i'm going to use Show you the dirt that will come out from this thing. The soap should be there, but not too much. Okay, Did you see that very dirty. Don't be afraid of that soap. That soap is the one we use to wash for the bottle. It doesn't have any smell. Please do not use the soap. The soap for plates. Don't use it. Add another one again. I added more soap. This is the second time. Very dirty. I'm not going to add soap for the third time. Rinse it until there is no soap. You see that? Can you see all these things? They are going to blend everything for you. Look at it. You see this? You see them? You see all those things? You have to select the ones, the good ones from it. You may say you don't have time for this. If you say you don't have time for this, you have time to cook dirty soup for your family. So what you will do, my advice for you, you will buy the melon before the day you want to cook it. Some of you already have melon at home. Okay? You wash it down. I'm going to show you how you can dry it. If you are the type that don't want to blend it when it's wet, you know, that's why I will not ask anybody to blend melon for me from Nigeria. I will not ask anybody to do that for me. I like blending it myself. So I want to make sure the video is not too long. I'm going to select the ones I can select, rinse it, and show you the last water. Third water. I'm still going to rinse it. So I've, I've finished washing my melon. The next thing is to dry it. This is the, I, I rinse it twice off camera. This is the third one to make sure there's no soap. This is the third one. You can see the water is already there. This is the first water. You see how dirty it is? This is the second water. Second. This is the third one. First, second, third. Then this one is the last one. So, don't put dirty melon. Wash your melon. Let me also show you how you can dry it if you don't want to blend this is with water. The pot on the fire already. This is the melon washed. If you know you are not going to use the melon that very day, after washing it, dry it under the sun. But if you know you want to cook the soup that very day, you use this method. I am cooking this soup now. That is why I have to dry it like this. You see the melon that was so dirty. 
that was so dirty. Look at it. This melon was very dirty. Now look at the color. Look at that. You see? I want to make sure the video is not too long. I will dry it off camera. It's just like this. I'll be stirring it until it's dried, okay? So I will do it off camera and I will show it to you later. So the melon is dried now. It's dried. If you know you want it to fry very well, then you fry it. But right now, it's dried. What I'm going to do next is to pour it in a tray to select some. If I'm not able to remove all, to select all those things away from it, you know. When I just pour it into the pot, the heat was high. Then I later lower the heat, you know. I lower the heat very well to the ending. So it's okay like this. Like this, I can blend it with dried blender. Okay, I will wait for it to get cold faster blending. Truly, I'm not in a hurry when I'm cooking soup. When I'm cooking, I may do everything fast. Does not mean I will do it anyhow. I take my time to take care of my food when I'm cooking it. I learned it for my mom. Yeah. Melo is cold now. The next thing I'm going to do now, I'm going to do it off camera. I'm going to do it like this and do it like this. The dirt will be on this side. I'll be removing the dirt just like so. And I'll do it off camera. We have come to the end of the video. Thanks so much for watching. Please like my video, subscribe to my channel, leave your comment below. Help me share this video. When you subscribe, remember to click on the notification bell for more videos. After you have finished blending your melon, just look for a nylon bag, pour it into a nylon bag and keep it in the freezer till the day you are using it. And check out this melon soup. Soup is ready. I will be uploading it after this video. Yes, that soup was very authentic very nice please remember to subscribe if you have not subscribed watch other videos on my channel bye bye